Hi there, my name's Daddy. I'd like to talk to you a little bit about the new forum. Really, sort of take you through, um, take you through, you know, the forum, what it's there for, and how you can get the most out of it. So, there's three ways that you can interact with with Supercell and and also other players. Um, really, there's Facebook, there's Twitter, but really, the, the biggest community out there is is the Supercell forums. So how do you get access to the Supercell forums? Well, you can go onto your onto your device, you press the COG icon. COG icon on your um, Clash account is on the right, on Heyday it's the top left. It's not actually there on Boom Beach, but it will be. So uh, once you press the COG icon, icon, you click on Help and Support, and you tap on the Forums button. Um, Clash it's in the middle, on, on Heyday it's on the left. And that will then open up a web, web browser that looks much like this, really. Um, the other way, of course, is you can just Google it, uh, forum, supercell, or go to forum.supercell.net, and it will take you to this page again. So the forums are a fantastic place for you to um, you know, interact, and typical questions and, 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 and sort of interactions, and sort of just sort of have a look and use it as a resource just to sort of read, or um, and lurk, I think, probably a general term. Um, or you can interact and you can ask questions about, you know, how do you do stuff, um, what you know I've got a problem you know can you help me resolve it uh, I mean so the forums aren't support but the forums can certainly help you get a form of support from from uh, other members you could also say look I've got a new feature that I think I'd like to uh, suggest and you know through through the years um, quite a lot of the features that have been suggested by um, uh, by forum members have actually been adopted into the games so Supercell do look at the forums quite quite a lot. They constantly have have a team of moderators that feed back information to them about you know general trends within the, the the players and you know what people like and what people don't like. And it's a great place also when you you know there's a new update to get sort of an idea of what's what's in the new update, how people are using it, and also if you've got any comments suggestions about that. So just to help you navigate a little bit, so the top page is Supercell announcements, you know things that they. They might like to tell us the forum rules. You know, sort of. Uh, there's the forum rules, but there's also the forum etiquette, and we're going to talk about the forum etiquette a little bit as well, which don't aren't really covered by the rules. Um, we also have the three games that are available from Supercell: so Clash of Clans, Heyday, and Boom Beach. So let's take a look at um, a typical structure of the Supercell forums. So the most these are laid out in, in in sort of roughly in sections that you know sort of people are particularly of interest. So contests and bugs and issues and um, neighborhood talk. Probably the first place you want to go to is general. General is where most posts appear. Now on all of the th all of the subsections, and you can see where in this in in in, in the forum you are. So you're in. The forum, Supercell Games, Heyday, and General, and you can navigate backwards and forwards through by clicking these links. But we're in General right now, and with all the f with all the subsections, you have stickies, and stickies are the, the pink, um, pink coloured ones up at the top. They're going to stay at the top all the time until until they're taken down. See, so there's two types of uh, two types of sticky. There's locked stickies, stickies that you can't add any replies to. And then there's unlock stickies, stickies that you can. So you can see there's no replies to that one, but all of these up here have lots of replies. So, you know, feedback for the new forum here. There's, there's three pages of forum feedback, 23 replied, replies and 664 views. The last post was by this person here, Happy Helen. And, um, well, it's, it's really nicely structured so that, you know, you say, look, you know, I, I've just seen new forums. So I'd like to add an extra bit of feedback. I'm going to... Read what other people have said. I like it mostly. The pie box is missing. Okay, I'm nipping to ask a question, but too much scrolling. So yeah, um, the, the problem is you don't really, you can't really reply. There's no, re there's no reply button because you haven't registered yet. You click that reply button and say you, you don't, you're not logged in. So how do you go about registering? Well, I'd like to take you through the registration process a little bit. Now, you can register in two ways. You can register via your Facebook account, or you can register via just, you know, just registering, really. Um, and that's what we're going to do today. Just going to click on the link. So, first of all, um, you need to choose a name. So, what are you going to call yourself? Well, I'm going to call myself Daddy Dad Son. Username is valid and not in use. Fantastic. So, I'm Daddy Dadson. 
and password. When you're choosing a password, it's really good form to not choose a password that you've used before and um, to use a password with some random random characters. So the way that I, I tend to do it is, um, so I'm going to put one, one, two, three, four, which is fine, anybody can guess that. I'm going to put the word supercell, oops, one, two, three, four, supercell, and then A, B, C, D in capitals. So one, two, three, four, supercell, A, B, C, D. There we go. And if you, it's, I mean, it's just a, a way that I do to remember, really. <laughs> so, uh, and then my email address is daddy, dad, son, at hot, is it outlook? Com. Com. Okay. Um, right. So I've got my password. It's got some capital letters. It's got some numbers, and it's got a uh, and it's got supercell in the middle. I use which is a format I use for different websites. Uh, random question: Which two games are supercell published for the iOS device? Name one of them. Well. Clash of Clans. Time zones, yep. Receive email from administrators and other other members. Well, it's entirely up to you, really. And I've read and abided by the Supercell Community Forum's rules. Okay. Complete registration. Thank you for registering. An email has been dispatched to daddydadson at outlook.com with details on how to activate your account. So if you go to daddydadson at outlook.com, you'll see there's a activate membership button here. So if you click on that, thank you for registering. Before we can activate it, one last step. Um, complete your registration, please visit, visit this URL. There we go. Registration is now complete. So you're logged in. <laughs> That's it. Your, your profile and everything is, is completely is completely blank. So um, if you look at the top here, you have a, a number of menus. So you have Welcome Daddy Dadson, which is basically your profile. You have notifications. This is things, you know, maybe somebody sent you a, a mail within, a personal message within the uh, forum. Somebody's added you as a friend, perhaps. Here's your profile, so you can see your profile as people see it. And your settings. The settings is where you can, you can sort of spruce up your profile, make it look a bit nicer. And so I think my profile is pretty boring, actually. So um, I'm, I'm going to actually change uh, change my profile picture. I'm going to change my avatar. So your profile picture is the picture that comes up when um, you know when people come and have a look at your profile. Really. So uh, if you just click on the Edit Profile Picture button, just there, um, and I'm going to put a nice picture in. I think uh, now you can choose a picture from the internet. So it's generally good form to upload a picture from your computer. So stick it on the Supercell. Um, site. So there we go. I've uploaded a picture of Fluffy Bunny. I'll save that page. Save that changes. There we go. So my profile picture is now a nice cute bunny, as it should be. You can also edit your avatar. So your avatar is um, is the picture that appears next to your posts when uh, people are looking at the forum. So you click again. You click on the Edit Avatar button. You can choose avatars that they, you know, Supercell will give you. Um, if you want to look like a like a um, sheep, that's fine. Personally, I think that sheep's quite scary. These are heyday avatars. Um, but again, I'm gonna I'm gonna choose a I'm gonna choose a picture from um, yeah from that I've downloaded from the internet that adequately describes me. There we go, a nice fluffy bunny. So then, if you look at your profile, you should see your profile picture appears, and any posts that you you have will, will have the other picture. So let's uh, let's change our profile a little bit as well. So let's edit the profile. Um, you can change your your date of birth. Um, bear in mind that all the information that you put here is going to be visible to other people, um, unless you decide to change that. So you know, I'm, I'm actually okay with my age and date of birth being known. Um, so February third. That's me. 1985. Who am I kidding? Um, you could put a link to your homepage, perhaps your instant messaging 
um, your your sort of various social aspects there. A little bit about yourself. I'm a new player uh, living in London, and uh, I love. No, oh, I like. I love. I love the game. London interests clash of clans and fluffy bunnies and my occupation is um, I'm a space man <laughs> yeah I'd like to encourage you to put your real stuff in real details in there but you know this is just for fun so then if you look at your profile that should should have updated At me, there you go. I'm a spaceman. Who, who's going to believe that? Hey? Okay, so your profile's been updated. You'll see within your profile, you'll see visitor messages. So people, you know, people could leave, come to your profile and actually not send you a personal message, but they'll just leave a message on your, uh, you know, on your board if you like. About me, uh, there's some friends that you might have. Um, and, uh, you can add friends, and as you add a friend, you see posts that they they put on the um, on the forum. They just appear in a friends list. Um, and again, you can customize the, the actual whole look and feel of the um, of the profile as well. Perhaps you want to change the color, the title text, you know, quite like, quite like red. Um, that would be very nice. Um, page background, you know, you can really go mad. Sort of have loads of fun with these. Um, there we go. Let's just uh, should we just save that? There we go. So if you look at your profile, oops, if you look at your profile there, it's all in what a lovely colour of yellow. Okay, so uh, now we've updated our profile, uh, we can see who we are. I'd like to, uh, I'd like to start posting. Thank you for watching part one. Please do check out part two by just by clicking the link where we're going to talk about creating threads, replying to threads, uh, how to get a great custom signature for 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 free, and. Uh, yeah, and a whole bunch more. Thank you. Bye for now.